Hi, my name is Dr. David Nicholl. I'm a neurologist in Birmingham. I want to welcome you to your telemedicine appointment. But before you come, uh, I just thought it gives you some tips and advice on what to do. Um, so just plan the appointment beforehand. Preferably have someone with you that can help. Uh, this helps me, for example, if you've got other problems like a tremor, that you're not holding a camera and struggling with it. Um, make sure you're in a room that's big enough that you can walk up and down. Um, and you know all of this will help. Uh, I've done some very quick clips on how not to do it. Um, I've got a very stupid patient along called me, okay? Um, and I'll just show you some of the things I've learned on how not to do it. Hopefully that'll help. So if you're a patient at home and you're doing a telemedicine consultation, I just thought I'd show you a couple of things, some tips on how not to do it, like this. So make sure you got the camera positioned correctly so it's not sticking up your nose. So make sure you do it in a room that's big enough so the doctor asks you to walk in, up and down. There's enough room. This really wouldn't do. Um, maybe think about the lighting. Don't be somewhere too, be, that's too bright because I can't see you. Or that's too dark because I won't be able to see you either. And again, try not to do come to neurology patients in your car because really I can't examine you in a car. There's just not enough space. So the message is really take this appointment seriously. Think about the environment that you want to talk to your doctor um, and so that we've got the time and we can just give you the best possible consultation. Uh, so just think about these basics and maybe have someone with you in the room to help because um, that would help as well you know to manage the camera and things like that and if you feel it's just not possible uh, speak to us and we'll find a different way and you know I love my dog but I wouldn't bring my dog to a clinic because you know they kind of bark and get in the way so maybe skip the dog during our patients okay it's not a good idea okay Now in those clips, okay, they might seem a bit silly, having a dog and that kind of thing, but um, the frivolous point really was to um, get you to all, everyone think about the environment they're in and that what we want to do is get the best uh, possible information and the best quality care for you. So just uh, try to avoid some of those little traps I showed in the clip just, um, and we look forward to meeting in the Department of Neurology soon. Thank you.